My name is Madeline Strong Woodley. I am um, executive committee member and in charge of Freedom Fund for the Boulder County Branch NAACP. And we are preparing for Juneteenth celebrations. Juneteenth celebrations for Boulder County. I also represent eCase. eCase is the acronym for Executive Committee for African American Cultural Events. eCase is operating uh, off of five, primarily five principles. They are education, celebration, solidarity, tribute, and service. And uh, those are, are very, very crucial and critical to our existence. The first one, as I said, was education. What we found is over the years, there are many people that still don't know what Juneteenth is or what it represents. Juneteenth is the fact that we did not celebrate independence for all people, particularly African-Americans, um, in 1776. However, um, on uh, June the 19th, 1865, there was a new coming, and uh, specifically for African-Americans enslaved in Galveston, Texas. And so two years later, these people realized that they had been freed. And what that meant, that meant that they no longer had to endure the selling of their children, division of their families, and all other things that we take for granted uh, that come with freedom. So Juneteenth represents freedom. And uh, it's crucial that we get that word out and that we educate, particularly our young people because they're the ones that's gonna carry the torch. They're the ones that's gonna make sure that these kinds of injustices do not repeat. And therein lies the work. The work includes the education, the celebration, the tribute, the solidarity, and ultimately the service. So this weekend, this coming weekend, we will be celebrating Juneteenth all over Boulder County. As of Friday, we're going to launch our flag raising. It would be the second this, this season flag raising ceremony. The flag raising ceremony will be held in what is now the Penfield Tate Memorial Building at 1777 Broadway. We will be raising the Juneteenth flag in cooperation uh, with Mayor Aaron Brockett, uh, State Representative Junie Joseph, City Council members, many of people from the community. It's at three o'clock at that memorial building. Please come. We have a lineup of, of uh, festivities, celebrations. We have, we've even assembled the Young People's Choir out of the Family Learning Center which is now even 42 plus years old, led by Brenda Lyle. Um, so we're looking forward to that. So Saturday, we'll be right here in Longmont at Roosevelt Park at one o'clock. Uh, City Councilwoman Shakita Yarbrough, this is the second year that she will have spearheaded a community family event that is gonna be phenomenal, I'm sure. It includes everything from jump, drum lines from our local uh, high schools, as well as a fashion show that uh, comes from an internationally known uh, designer. Uh, in addition to many, many other things, there's something there for everybody. Everything is free. All of these events are free and open to the public. And then comes that Saturday, and then comes Sunday. Sunday, we start off at First Congregational Church in Boulder, we are really, really, really promoting our youth and developing and building our youth. We will be um, featuring a master's class led by a black author, children's author, Naisha Williams. Naisha is a young lady that is multi-published, very, very skilled, and will be sharing how to get that done and teaching our young people how to become published. Then we are down to Sunday afternoon. We'll be at the Longmont Library right next door <laughs> where we will 
have Neosha Williams again carrying on that master's class, but the age difference is what's going to matter. It's going to be from the ages of 16 to 23. So come with your, well, we'll have notepads for you. So just come with open, eye, open ears, minds, hearts to learn and learn how to become published. That's Sunday. Then Monday, the day of, that's the day of celebration. That's our national uh, federal holiday. And we are bringing the author, the children's author of Juneteenth, the grandmother of Juneteenth, Miss Opal Lee. We will be bringing the author of that book. Her name is Alice Faye Duncan out of Memphis, Tennessee. She will be right here uh, in Colorado. That Monday is gonna be at CU campus, the Glenn Miller Ballroom, and uh, what can I tell you? It's gonna be phenomenal. Juneteenth, 2023, Boulder, Colorado, Boulder County, Colorado. We're looking forward to an exciting, exciting time. Thank you for everything that you've done to support us in the past and we look forward to future endeavors. Thank you so much.